The large bar mill produces 1 million tons annually, specializing in carbon and alloy steel grades for automotive industry applications. Starting blooms are 390 by 530 millimeters, 3.5 to 8 meters, hot cold charged. The reheating furnace heats 200 tons per hour for processing. The high-pressure water primary descaler removes surface scale from heated blooms, ensuring a clean, smooth surface for further processing. The 47 inches breakdown mill, two high reversing type, has 1,200 mm rolls and 2,600 mm barrel length. Bar manipulators with rams and tilting fingers precisely handle and position bars during processing, enabling smooth transitions between stages. They ensure accurate alignment and efficient movement of bars through the mill. The transfer table at the breakdown mill exit smoothly conveys process bars to the next stage, ensuring efficient handling. The hydraulic shear bar, with a 1,000-ton cutting capacity, precisely crops bars to required lengths, ensuring consistent quality. The 45 inches turning of intermediate square products before the continuous mill ensures uniform rolling, while high-pressure descaling removes surface contaminants. Water secondary descaler before continuous mill. The six-stand mill features Redring Series 5 and CGA sizing stands. Redring Series 5 stands feature 1,030 mm rolls, 1,200 mm barrel, and quick stand changes. CGA sizing stands have 870 mm roll distance, 1,200 mm barrel, and quick stand changes. ProScan laser profile gauge measures bar dimensions for precise quality control. Exit roller table guides bars. Layer forming ensures organized cooling. Removable heat retaining covers maintain temperature and prevent rapid cooling. Fully automated plant ensures efficient, precise operations with minimal manual intervention. The cutoff machines feature two metallic disc saws with a 1,800 mm nominal diameter. They perform head cropping and divide bars into commercial lengths. These saws ensure precise cutting and consistent length for the final product. The bar end marking station applies identification marks to each bar end, ensuring traceability and consistent quality control throughout production. Turnover cooling beds rotate bars continuously during cooling to ensure uniform temperature distribution and prevent warping or deformation. The ProScan laser profile gauge precisely measures bar dimensions, detecting deviations to ensure accurate sizing and high-quality standards. The flying dividing shear, with a 300-ton cutting capacity, slices bars to precise lengths while in motion for efficiency. The exit roller table guides bars out of the mill, while layer forming organizes them for cooling and subsequent handling. Cutoff machines use 1,800 mm discs for head cropping and dividing bars into commercial lengths, ensuring precise and efficient cutting. The bar end marking station applies clear identification marks on each bar end, aiding in traceability and quality control throughout production. Bars are collected, grouped, and bundled into manageable sizes for transport, ensuring secure handling and organized delivery to customers. Bar bundles weigh 2 to 10 tons and measure 4 to 12 meters long. The bundle binding station secures bar bundles with sturdy bindings. The run-out roller table conveys bar bundles to the weighing station, ensuring accurate weight measurement before final processing and shipping.
seamlessly integrate detailed CAD designs into the cutting machine for precise, automated cutting based on exact specifications. Add markings to parts. Automated systems apply essential markings for alignment and fitting directly onto parts based on CAD data. This ensures accurate positioning and reduces manual measurement errors, facilitating precise assembly and enhancing the efficiency of subsequent welding processes by providing clear, consistent reference points. Layouting not required. The automated system directly uses CAD data, eliminating the need for manual layout preparation and reducing setup time. The machine automatically inscribes precise markings on parts, ensuring correct alignment and seamless fit during assembly. Precisely shapes edges for optimal welding fit and strength. Cut with perfect hole technology. This advanced cutting technology ensures precise and clean holes and cuts by using high accuracy methods to minimize deviations. It eliminates the need for post-processing like grinding or deburing, resulting in smooth, high-quality edges. Perfect hole technology enhances the fit and performance of components, reduces waste, and ensures consistent results, which streamlines the workflow and improves overall productivity. Automated cutting with advanced technology eliminates the need for additional grinding by producing clean, precise edges. This reduces post-processing time, labor costs, and ensures a smooth, high-quality finish right after cutting, improving overall efficiency. The machine's versatile capabilities extend to cutting nozzles up to 010 inches, 250 millimeters, allowing it to handle multiple types of cuts and components on a single setup. This integration reduces the need for separate equipment, streamlines the workflow, and improves production efficiency. By consolidating nozzle cutting with other vessel preparations, it minimizes handling, lowers setup times, and ensures consistency across all parts. The machine features an automatic chuck system that securely holds parts up to 014 inches, 350 millimeters. This ensures precise positioning during cutting, reduces manual handling, and enhances accuracy, resulting in consistent, high-quality cuts with minimal operator intervention. The machine ensures a smooth, flawless finish with every cut, eliminating the need for additional finishing work. This high-quality surface reduces rework, enhances overall aesthetics, and improves the fit and performance of the final components. Automated systems handle the entire cutting process from start to finish, including complex cuts and precise markings. This automation reduces the need for manual labor, minimizes human error, and ensures consistent high-quality results, allowing operators to focus on other tasks and improving overall efficiency. The starting material is a billet measuring 160 by 160 millimeters, 15,000 millimeters long, with an approximate weight of 2,900 kilogram. The product range includes round bars, 16 to 50 millimeters diameter, deformed bars, 8 to 40 millimeters diameter, equivalent squares, angles, 30 minus 120 millimeters, and equivalent channels and flats, processed via a 160 TPH walking hearth reheating furnace. The roughing mill features six SHS star, housing list stands with rolls measuring 655 590 of a millimeter in diameter, ensuring precise and efficient material reduction. The intermediate mill is equipped with six SHS star housing list stands, each with a roll diameter of 655 590 of a millimeter. It includes an automatic stand changing car, allowing for rapid and efficient roll changes.
The Danielli Automation System offers comprehensive control over process technology and equipment, ensuring precise operation, efficiency, and high-quality output. The finishing mill has six SHS star housingless stands with 490 380ths of a millimeter diameter rolls, featuring an automatic stand changing car for quick adjustments. The four strand slit rolling process splits the material into four separate strands, enhancing production efficiency and output volume. The QTB, Quenching and tempering of bars system enhances the tensile strength and weldability of deformed bars through controlled cooling. The finishing mill operates at speeds up to 18 meters per second, optimizing production efficiency and throughput of finished products. The cooling bed is a 102 by 12 meter rake type, designed for efficient cooling and handling of long products. The CCL, Continuous Straightening and Cutting to Length system, provides precise straightening and cutting of metal products. It continuously straightens material to eliminate distortions and ensures uniform dimensions. After straightening, the system cuts the material to specified lengths with high accuracy, accommodating varying lengths and tolerances. The weighing and final collecting facilities are designed to accurately weigh and organize finished products for dispatch. This system includes high-precision scales that ensure exact weight measurements and automated systems for bundling and stacking. It efficiently manages product collection, reducing manual handling and improving throughput. Finished products are supplied in bundles or stacks, ranging from 2 to 7.5 tons and 6 to 24 meters long. Commercial Metals Company has revolutionized the steel industry with its introduction of hot rolled spooled rebar, becoming the first and only producer of this innovative product in the United States. This breakthrough is designed to address several key challenges faced by the industry, particularly in terms of efficiency, safety, and cost effectiveness. One of the standout features of this spooled rebar is its twist free design. This innovation ensures that the rebar is tangle free during decoiling, significantly enhancing safety and reducing potential accidents on site. The twist-free spools also lead to improved bar straightness, which reduces waste and rejects, further boosting productivity. Another notable advancement is the introduction of larger spool sizes. These larger spools help to minimize yield loss by providing increased linear feet per spool. This design not only improves productivity rates, but also cuts down on the downtime required for changing out spools, making the entire process more efficient. In addition, Commercial Metals Company has developed high tonnage and ultra-compact spools that address inventory management challenges. These spools are designed to minimize storage space requirements, streamline handling and transportation, and ultimately reduce costs. The compact design also enhances safety during shipping, handling, and machine loading. The spooled rebar from Commercial Metals Company also underscores a commitment to sustainability through its focus on recycling and efficient fabrication processes. By reducing waste and improving overall operational efficiency, the company supports a more sustainable and environmentally friendly approach to rebar production. 
A portable pipe cutter is a compact, versatile tool designed for cutting large diameter pipes. It features adjustable blades, a robust frame for stability, and precise controls for accurate cuts. Scaffolding provides stable, adjustable platforms for safe access to heights. A rotator with a speed controller is used to rotate large pipes smoothly during cutting operations. It allows precise adjustment of rotation speed, ensuring uniform cutting and reducing vibration. The speed controller helps maintain consistent cutting conditions, improving accuracy and efficiency while minimizing potential damage to the pipe or equipment. A safety overhead crane is essential for lifting and positioning heavy pipes. It includes safety features such as limit switches, emergency stops, and load sensors to ensure secure handling and prevent accidents. Initialization point and reference lines guide accurate alignment and cutting. A dry run is a critical preparatory step in the pipe cutting process conducted without actually cutting the pipe. Its purpose is to simulate the cutting operation, to identify any potential issues, and ensure everything is set up correctly before starting the actual work. During a dry run, the cutting machine, rotator, and other equipment are operated as if the pipe were being cut, allowing the operator to check the alignment and movement of the machinery. Confirm that the portable pipe cutter is correctly aligned with the pipe and that all components, such as blades and support ports are functioning properly. Ensure the rotator turns the pipe smoothly and at the correct speed. Adjustments can be made to the speed controller if necessary to achieve the desired rotation. Inspect the scaffolding setup to ensure it provides stable and safe access to the entire pipe circumference. Make sure there is adequate clearance and support for the operator. Detect any mechanical or procedural problems before actual cutting begins, such as misalignment, unexpected vibrations, or safety concerns. Final check. Perform a thorough inspection of the portable pipe cutter, rotator, safety overhead crane, and all related equipment. Verify that everything is in optimal working condition and that all safety features are operational. Ensure the initialization point is correctly set and that reference lines on the pipe are accurately marked. These lines guide the cutting process and are crucial for precision. Double-check all safety protocols, including the placement of PPE, emergency procedures, and the stability of scaffolding and the crane.